Carl here. Today in Power BI, we're going to be making a Sankey chart. Sankey chart is in the Power BI marketplace and is Sankey 3.0. In order to download that, we want to go to get more visuals and we just want to type in a simple word Sankey. This is Microsoft Verify, even though it's three stars. So you just click on Sankey and the next thing you want to do is just add it and then you will have an update right here. So now you have the Sankey chart. So we're just gonna go ahead and click on the Sankey chart. We're gonna increase the size in our report view. And in our Sankey chart, we want we have three several different options here. We have sources, destinations, weight, and source labels. So we want to start with the source. So our source that I'm gonna start with is gonna be the region. And once we do the region, the destination from there is gonna be our product categories and now we get to see what that looks like from uh, in the psyche chart so now you get to see in each region how all these different product categories connected now we want to go into the weight so once we add in the weight and i'm going to add sales now we see that which one had the most sales and like i always do i want to eliminate the food and spices so we'll eliminate food and spices and now we're looking at the psyche chart from a weighted perspective. So it's clear that the South region had the most sales. And if you look at this on this Sankey chart, it kind of shows you the biggest, the biggest amount of sales gross was here in bread. And then the smallest amount will be um, our appetizer. And we can just click on that. And if we do the Northeast region, the same thing, you see that the bigger chart here is the bread while the smallest chart is here at beer. In addition to that, let's go ahead and go into format. So say we wanted to format this, we can come here into data labels and we can have our data labels on or off. So if we turn them off, then that's what we see. We see those data labels go away. We can also change the font and the font family as well as the text line. We can do data link labels. If we turn those on, this is what it will look like. So now we have some data link labels, which is basically showing us where where it's starting at and where it's going to as well as the sum of sales so we have some data link labels and we can increase and decrease the text size in that you can keep that on or you can turn that off then we have some links and then we have nodes and our nodes is basically the colors so if we wanted to change northeast to black we can change northeast to black so those are our nodes if we wanted to change some of the scaling so, so provide a minimum option we can turn it on or we can turn it off and we can also enable this here or we can turn that off as well and then we have cycle displaying which really doesn't change anything so we'll just ignore that one and that is how you create a sankey chart in power bi